Welcome to Anything and Nothing Week 7. This is Tamara. I'm Michelle. And we're going to kick things off by talking about a very spicy thriller that is on Netflix right now. Um, I just got school to it, but it definitely premiered uh, back in February. So, the premise is, a single mother enters a world of twisted mind games when she begins an affair with her psychiatrist boss while secretly befriending his mysterious wife. Why would you do the latter? And you probably shouldn't do the former, but Michelle, what do you think? I'll let you go first. Um, so I did like the show. It was pretty slow at the beginning. Super um, slow at the beginning. I started it. I I saw the first episode. By the time we got it got to the second episode, I was probably like five minutes in and I fell asleep. Yep. Then Marion and you were texting about it and I was like, okay, well maybe it's better, so I'll give it another go and I got into it. Yep. Um, it was a good series. Mm -hmm. Um Do you think it can come back for twist, a season two? No, it's gotta be eliminated. Yeah. I mean, how can you go any further? I agree, um, I agree. But you're talking I, about the ending. Yeah, the you can't go any further. Um, as far as the build up to the show, like to the end, like I love the fact that I had no clue that the ending was going to happen. Yeah. Um, I thought that that was too coincidental how she met this man at a bar and then like the next day he's her boss. Like That was weird. Was but like, that was very... The world, the world is small, but... Is it but it wasn't small? calculated. Like that part no, I think was natural, but like super random. But it was just like, mm. Super, super random. But the wife though, her... Oh yeah, spoiler alert. Strange. Like hopefully the fuck you watched it because if you didn't... Tune out because we about to ruin shit. Um, the wife running into her was definitely pl planned. Oh, sure. I didn't know that. I sure. totally like assumed. Oh, she just ran into the girl. Yeah. So I definitely, without knowing the end, I knew that the wife did that on purpose, but okay. I didn't. I didn't know why. Yeah. I didn't know if it was because maybe she saw because she went to the office. True. Oh, so yeah. So it's not yeah. like she didn't see the girl. I I just thought What's maybe the black? she I was the... a jealous wife that might have seen someone. But did the wife, because I'm trying to remember the first episode when he did go in to like talk to the head of the office. And she was hiding. Yeah, she was hiding. So I don't know if the wife ever saw her. But it, I didn't know. Yeah. Uh, but how else would she have known, right? Besides the fact that we knew that she would know. But I, fucking crazy person. So in my mind, I was like, it seemed intentional mm -hmm. when she met her. So it was like. That's intentional. She must yeah. have seen her somewhere or yeah. knew something. Yeah. Um, but I didn't think she knew the, the way that she knew. So I assumed that instead of the whole like spirit movement, mm -hmm. I just assumed that she was crazy, killed the her best friend because she thought he was going to ruin her and David's relationship because she seems way too obsessed with him. That's what you thought? I thought so. I thought, but I'm just like, how the fuck is that bitch so like strong that she can pull this grown man into the well? But like, I guess, does the spirit going in, does, does she also get extra, does she get the man muscles too? Girl, I don't know. It was I, very strange. I mean, that was, so I was waiting for the end to explain why she killed her friend. I didn't think that jealousy had anything to do with her killing oh, her friend. Oh, I thought, because well, she was worried never, that they were, because he was obsessed with her. Right. David loved her. Right. Um, so I, I think I also, so that that was just weird to me. And then I want to rewatch it because people were saying, like, you should have seen, like, clues that, like, you know, she was shooting herself up with heroin. She was never yeah. a heroin addict. But here's the thing. Nobody explained why the fuck she was in that mental institute. Right. I thought she was. Exactly. Uh, I thought she was a drug addict. Because exactly. he was a drug addict. So exactly. I just assumed everybody was a drug addict. Yep. Same. And so I didn't think anything of it when she was shooting herself with heroin. Yeah, I didn't either. And yeah. when he came to the house and was like. Hey, like I bought some. She was like, I don't want to do it, but I assume she didn't want to break her fucking. Um, she didn't want to break her sobriety. Right. Not. Right. I'm not a heroin addict. Yep. That's not my thing. Yep, I agree. So I, agree. I just I I, I also didn't it. notice the uh, personality differences. Like you can now thinking about it after we know what happened. Yeah. I was like. I probably could have picked up on that being yeah. his personality. Right. Oh, I guess we didn't say at the end the wife ended up being the friend that was at the rehab mental institution with her. Yeah. How that happened. And right. then actually ended up going into the uh, uh, black girlfriend, the side chick girl, and, yeah. and marrying him. What do you call that? Like, is it just like spirit, like transfer? I guess. Like, yeah. This is fake. I don't, 
Yeah. What do we call it? I, guess I don't know. It was just very troubling to spirit me. Spirit transfer. And then I felt right. I feel bad for the sun, and I feel bad for David. Of course. So this is my thing with the sun. Why not leave the sun with the daddy? Like, I why? think she needed to keep up the front. She was a dedicated mother. She like loved her. She she loved her son. I think it would have been a little bit weird. But the, I'm hoping that like because of the sun, people pick up on it. Because right. even like her ex was like, "Are you okay?" And then you, she she kind of like shoved him. Like she's like, "Come on, right?" And like that's not how she was. She didn't even hug him. She didn't embrace him. Yeah. David, I think is just an idiot, and he was fooled for eight years already. I also right. didn't understand, and maybe you can help right. me. How could the husband not know that? Why did he say? Why did he think he needed to stay with her? He, it sounded like he thought he needed to stay with her because he would have gone to jail for helping her hide this body that she killed. But he really didn't help her that much. Like, but he, she did, he knew about it. He knew about it. Did he didn't go to jail anything. for that. Oh, really? Yes. To know that she had a, bo- a dead body and she killed someone? Yeah. Mm, but I would have like said like I was afraid that she was going to kill me or something. Even though he's a man and right. she's a woman. And do you not remember the key point that she said, I dropped your watch in the... Um, oh, fuck, that's right. Yeah, so they're not going to think it's her. They'll think it's him. So that's why he was stuck with her. Yeah. Yeah, that's true. Um, But that was so weird. I, I thought the end was like, oh! It was definitely... I was not turn. expecting I that. I did not expect it all. Mm-hmm. I would have... I mean, I knew the guy was gay. And he knew he did. Okay. The her best friend. Yes. Are you sure? I thought he was obsessed with her. You think that's why he wanted to be with her boyfriend, her husband? I think he hated his. I thought he hated his life, and he just wanted to be no, in somebody's body. At the re, okay, at the re, the mental institution place, he was said the lady said something to him like she doesn't want you, and he was like. Well, I just want dick anyway. It was like some. He said something. Oh, I missed that. I must, I must have been on my phone. Yeah, he said something in that regard, and she was like, "He's not what I want anyway." So, yeah. Oh, I missed that completely. I didn't know he was gay. So, yeah, I knew, we're having this dialogue. I knew that was his thing. So, no, I had no idea. And like, he was kind of feeling him at the house. You didn't see like he seemed like he did. He really liked him. He as did. Well. He did. He seemed like he peeped him. But I, yeah. Okay, he just my, didn't put it together. No, because I thought he was obsessed with her and he yeah. wanted her. And, like, she was so concerned of, like, are are they going to get along? And I think I, I thought that she was afraid of that because she knew how obsessed he was yeah. with her. Yeah. <gasps> I mean, yeah, but I think it was Rain, more for her. like, free. That was, like, his only friend. And so, yeah, yeah, that was part of it. But Yeah. Man, she should have never taught him how to do that. Like, do you think, like, how do you do it, though? Because... There's like know. fingers. I was like, maybe I can do it. No, maybe I can do it. I, I don't think that's true. You want to practice after? No. <laughs> what well, would not, it be like to live in Michelle's body I for one whole day? Want any kind of body transfer. Yeah, I know. Can you imagine being in my body for one whole day? People would be like, "Who are you? Yeah, they You're a little subdued know. right now." Right. Yeah. Yeah. You're not freaking out over everything. They would definitely think something is wrong. Yeah. And everyone else would think something is wrong with me. Yeah. They're like, what are you doing? You're in speed or something? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so uh, any other thoughts on it? No, I think I it's a it. great watch. I think you should check it out. If you, I mean, you probably have checked it out if you're watching this. Mm-hmm. But um, I think I'm going to recommend it to people because I thought it was a good I show. thought it was too. I thought it was too. Only six episodes. and I Oh, yeah, it was a quick watch. Very binge-worthy. Yeah. But easy. slow. It was slow at the beginning. Definitely slow. You have to be committed to it. Yeah. It didn't really pick up until, like, I feel like episode four, to be honest. Yeah. So yeah, definitely don't watch it at night. Yeah, watch it at on like a Sunday afternoon. Yeah, yeah, cool. All right, all right. Thanks. Bye, bye.